Located in the center of Madhya Pradesh, the state's most beautiful city Indore is not only the cleanest city of India but is also the largest and the most populated city in the state. Lalbagh Palace, Rajwada Palace, Sharafa Market and Patar Pani Waterfalls are some of the most popular tourist attractions of the city due to which a large amount of tourists come here to visit this city. Being the financial capital of Madhya Pradesh, import and export are done here in great numbers. But due to all these factors, the population of the city is rapidly increasing. Roads are becoming jam-packed and public transportation here being crowded. And thus, the city is in a need of a modern rapid transit system which will come in the form of the Indore Metro. The Indore Metro is a rapid transit network consisting of six corridors covering a distance of 94 kilometers which will have trains running both in elevated and underground tracks as well as a few kilometers at grade. The project is being implemented by the Madhya Pradesh Metro Rail Corporation or MPMRCL. The estimated cost of the project is 12,000 crore funded by the Asian Development Bank and New Development Bank. As told earlier, the system will have six corridors. Line 1A would be from Sri Aurobindo Hospital to Indore Bypass 1. Line 1B from Sri Aurobindo Hospital to Regional Park. Line 2 from Devas Naka to MHOW. Line 3, the ring line between Palacia and MR10. And lastly, Line 4 from MR9 to Indore Bypass 4. Out of these six lines, only the Line 3, that is the ring line, has been approved and will be constructed for Phase 1. Color coded as the yellow line, this corridor is 33.53 km long. The line will have 30 stations and it will connect important places such as Airport, Rajwada, Bada Ganpati, Railway Station, Palacia, Vijayanagar, Super Corridor, etc. The depot of this line would be built at Gandhinagar. Many of the stations on this line would be based on multimodal integration which will have various connection points with airports, railway stations, bus stops, etc. The first phase is being constructed between Gandhinagar and Mumtaz Bars Colony for 17 kilometers which is being expected to open for commercial use by the year 2024. Recently, MPMRCL had awarded a contract to Alstom to supply 156 coaches for the Indore and Bhopal Metro. Out of these trains, 25 metro trains with 3 coaches each would be used for the yellow line, whereas 27 trains with 3 coaches each would be running on the Bhopal Metro. When the project gets completed, Indore will not only see a major transformation in its infrastructure, but also commuting in this city will be more easier than earlier. This detailed video has been made by a lot of efforts. So, please appreciate our efforts by liking this video, sharing it to your loved ones and by subscribing to our channel so that we can bring more and more such videos to you. Thank you for watching and have a nice day.